Collective. Hey, Collective. I'm back. Thank you guys for watching my channel. She's got to be a Collective. I'm back with an energy check-in. These messages right here are for everybody. Take the parts that resonate with you, please, and thank you, and leave the rest for the rest, okay? If you guys are seeking a personal, I um, pin my website in the description box below, or you could just simply Google I'm still healing.net, stroll all the way down to the bottom and get your slot. You guys, my personals go on sale every weekend, okay? So get your slot and get your sale while you can because they fill up quickly. Also, I'll pin down there, you guys, this beautiful Rose Company that goes by the name Rose Forever. Their website will be pinned down there next to my website. Check them out, you guys. They still have sales going on at this time, and shipping is free. So take advantage for the ones who yet have not got their box. Also, it'll be followed by a discount code. So not only will you receive up to 90% in all of the stuff they got to give you, put in my discount code, which is GIFT25, G-I-F-T with the number 25, and you'll receive additional 25% on top of your order, okay? So treat yourself. Why not? Energy check-in for the collective spirit. White light, holy angels, I call upon you to guide me. Thank you for using me as a vessel. I'm grateful. Please continue to protect me and my foundation. Protect the collective and their foundation. No weapon be a to come against us, shall prosper. Return to sender all black magic, evil entity, and spell work being sent. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, my throat is closing up now. Send me more spirit messages for the collective. Show me more. Somebody's trying to close something off for you. I block something. I just heard interference already knowing the T. Mm. Somebody could be going to a pra practitioner about you, collective. Show me more. She arrives. It's going to be all right, though. Something is going to be shown to you, and then you got happily ever after here. This could have something to do with the relationship or who you intertwine with at this time. They could be speaking about that. Why is already knowing a T here for collective spirit? Why is already knowing the T here for the collective? What is this about? Already knowing the T inside on this. You could already be aware of this. The Queen of Wands, sheesh. The Page of Pentacles and then the Six of Wands. So something that you got going on. An idea, a plan, a strategy. You're going to be successful in it. Mmm. Show me a little bit more on this Queen of Wands before I say that. Confirm what I'm about to say, Spirit. Temperance here in reverse, patience, divine timing. Whatever this is or whatever plot this is that someone has going on, it's not going to work because it's not the right time to do it. So if you got a plan and you're ready to set it in motion and you're feeling confident about it, yes, indeed, it's going to be 100% successful, but you have to give it more time. You have to give it more energy and you have to learn some more about whatever this is that you got going on, okay? Now, this could be your person coming towards you because they feel this magnetic uh, pull with you showing up here as the queen of wands, you the king of wands. This could be a Sagittarius I'm talking about. Or I'm talking to a Sagittarius at this time. Some sort of idea here, some sort of strategy, plan. One on the page of Pentacles, Spirit. One on the page of Pentacles, Spirit Collective. Four of Pentacles. Something starting off slow. Something that you're building here. That you're keeping to yourself. Someone is moving too fast. Now, if this is someone here, this is a Sagittarius, and you could be any other sign. You could be, a, you got Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn showing up, and then strong Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo with this whole situation right here. This is a plot. Someone is strategizing to do something. I feel like the plot is, the plan is going to be successful here, but it takes more time. It's not the right time to put it out there yet. One last card on this situation. It's something about divine timing here and your patience is running thin. Someone's patience is running too thin and that's how you fail. Because you, right, you get right there at the mark. You know, right before you finish, right before you hit the finish line, you stop. And then you have to start all over again. So they're telling you to like get your patience in control. Already know that something is going to happen to you. Already know that you're going to be victorious. The higher fight here is showing up. This is something serious here. I, I just heard high count, higher counsel. So this could have something to do with the court case. This could have something to do with uh, something being overruled. Something being in your favor. This could be pertaining to a child with the page of pentacles out here. 
Four of Pentacles, somebody didn't want to like take care of something financially and you already knew it was a matter of time that something was going to happen like this. I just feel like somebody is moving too fast though. Like the overall message, they keep saying moving too fast, but you already know that something is like your plan is set in motion already. But if you if you do something too quickly here or jump the broom too quickly, something is going to fail and they want you to know that. Why is chill vibes here? Yeah, your patience, they need you to like sit back and... and intertwine with yourself they want you to sit back here and observe with the four of pentacles chill chill vibes out here they want you to something that you're working on you're building or some sort of wealth here the sun exposure here at the right time somebody's gonna be pushed in the limelight or you will get seen or you like you will be victorious over a lot of people but it takes time it's not the right time to reveal something yet show me more spirit with the chill vibes the sun here this could have somebody, somebody is trying or somebody is getting ready to expose a Taurus or a, a fire sign is getting, uh, or a Taurus is getting ready to expose a fire sign, some sort of exposure. Yeah, due to, look, due to some type of portrayal, you got chill vibes here clarifying with um, the sun and a ten of swords. So some type of portrayal, some type of plan, some type of plot, somebody moved too quickly here and thought that they was going to be successful, and that's not the case. Now, if this is you, Collective, they want you to know, before you do anything and jump the gun too quickly here, make sure that some of your plan is set in motion. This has something to do with someone's intentions here. Show me more on this, Spirit, for the Collective. I'm here. We back in business, boys. Who is that? We back in business. I don't know. Show me more. I just feel like somebody celebrated too fast off of your downfall. They thought that they was going to come up pretty quickly off your downfall and it ain't happening like that. You already aware of this person. You know who this person is. You know what they've been trying to do. You know they've been throwing spell work and shit at you trying to get you to fall. But obviously here, it, that, ain't, that ain't the universe plan for you. The plan for you here is to be successful. It's already written in the stars. You're the teacher. You're the divine instructor here. Something like that is going on with this situation here. One more chill vibes here. This could be a Libra. You got Leo out here. You got strong fire, Aries, Leo, Sash. So it could be any one of those three signs that's out here. And then it's intertwined here with the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, and some sort of portrayal that's being seen or that will come. And you already aware of this. Sagittarius, uh, feminine could play a big role in this as well. Show me more. Yeah, look at that. The magician here showing up in reverse position for chill vibes. Yeah, whatever somebody is doing, you got the queen of wands out here with the magician here in reverse. Whatever somebody was doing or the whole plot here was to keep you stuck or take something or hold something back from you or get you roused up just to ghost you. Whatever this situation is, they did it the time in here. They, it wasn't the right time for them to do something to you or just whatever this is right here. Some sort of portrayal is being seen. Whoever the, whoever this manipulative motherfucker is, this could be a Virgo, this could be a Gemini. I see Sagittarius, I see Virgo, Gemini, and Leo. Taurus as well out here. One more spirit. Chill vibes for the collector. Ace of Swords here and Chariot. Yeah, look at that. That's the fucking truth. Ace of Swords here, upright, and a Chariot reverse. You could be dealing with a, a Cancer. So you got Aquarius showing up, Cancer showing up, Virgo, Gemini, Leo, Sagittarius here, and Taurus in this situation. But you're clear on something here. They want you to don't move forward or they want you to see something before you're able to make this final decision. Clarity here is coming towards you. Exposure, clarity, you being pushed out there in the light. It's like somebody trying to keep you hidden, but they're out there. Now the roles are reversing here. Somebody is being stuck and you're being like, you're giving a green light to move forward. Somebody did something too fast. I feel like they portrayed you and went towards someone else and thinking the grass was greener, but clearly it's not. And now this person gonna have to be stuck here because you got happily ever after. They want you to chill out. They are they you you into tarot. You already up ten. You two ten steps ahead of whoever this person is that betrayed you with this ten of swords out here. Wait, the right time in here. The sun, the ace of swords with chill vibes. Something is gonna be seen to you. Something is gonna be revealed to you. The magician here showing up in reverse, chariot in reverse. Somebody is gonna be stuck. They can't make no more no more uh, forward movements or nothing. Somebody is in spiritual jail here. Thank you, spirit. Why is happily ever after? Why is happily ever after here for the collective? Yeah, somebody, mm, somebody dug their own hole here with you, just period. Happily ever after, nine of cups showing up. 
wish fulfillment here is showing up for you. It's like something has been broken. You, you're clear the magician here is in reverse. Something, whatever, whoever this queen of wands is that was doing all of this little snake shit to you or uh, work on you here. Now it's like they're in spiritual jail. All their gifts are being taken to you. Now you're taken, taken from them and something here is being given to you. Now you're clear. Now you're in the green light to go. You got the green light to go here and someone is stuck. But they're going to reveal you who this, they're going to reveal just to, just who this person is to you. Y'all cannot talk today for some reason. This person could be a, a Leo, Libra, Cancer, Aquarius, Virgo, or Gemini that plays a big role in this here. Happily ever after with the Nine of Cups spirit for the collective. Thank you. We grateful for these messages. Eight of Swords. Told you somebody is going to spiritual jail. Somebody's gifts are being taken. Eight of Cups. You can't make it up. You can't make it up. While your wig, while your happily ever after is coming in, someone else is going to spiritual jail, and they gonna feel it worse than you've ever. But you already know this, to um, uh, collective. You already know this, Sagittarius. You already know this, Taurus. You already know this, Virgo. This Leo. This Gemini. This Aquarius. This Cancer. Libra out here. If somebody is a Cancer Pisces here or a Scorpio that's watching this read, I feel like whatever you went through. Just know that uh, your rainbow here, something is going to shine for you. And someone else here is like being spiritually whooped from everything that they got here with this Eight of Cups and Eight of Swords. And you know, that worst fear was for you to really walk on and really, really leave them. And I feel like this is the last, this is the last time. That's what I got. This is what I have for you, Collective. I hope this helped you. I hope you got some type of peace and clarity. If you did, please don't forget to hit the like, the comment, and subscribe button. And also, you guys, don't forget, get your slot while you can. My personals are on sale. They go on sale every weekend. So if you can't get one this weekend, don't worry about it. Put your order in for next weekend, okay? I love y'all. Until next time, peace.